guys, Dilbs are here. It's back to another banger uh, video, and today, guys, new test has just gotten an update. That's right, this is new, new chess. So now, the first thing I've changed is that I've included a couple new opening things, like this one, and this one, and this one. That includes some of the new pieces. And I've already seen this part. Uh, I've also added new things here. That also include some of the new pieces and things that I've added since the last video. But the first major change is cards. This is not supposed to be there, because this is also a card. So, um, as you see here, there is like, um, minus two for drawing a card. And, we draw a card, you, um, pick one at random using a random number generator. Here they all are. They go to your inventory. You can use them on any turn, or you can just save them in your inventory waiting to use them. I already gone through this in the last video. Okay, here's Lesser Pawn 2. It can move one space in front of it. It only captures to its right diagonal. And Lesser Pawn only captures to its left diagonal. So, yeah. Here's the Upside Down Pawn. It moves like a pawn, but like, it's the other way around. So, like, a pawn would normally move like this, but these pawns move like this. And opposite rules and moving twice on the first turn and promotion still apply, but you have to go to the other side of the board instead. Hey, here's the Lestis pawn. It can only capture to its left diagonal and no other moving is allowed. Have you seen this thing? Uh, this is the square, squared, squared. It moves in a 2x2 two two square. And here's the short knight. It moves one space diagonally. Um, I was initially gonna make, like, you know, a knight how it moves two spaces in one direction and one space in another direction. I was gonna make it, but only moves one space in both directions, and I realized it's just diagonal. And here's the portal. It's a pretty fun piece. If you move a piece through it, it will take you to a different portal of the same color. Anyway, he, so, I added checkers to this. So, now you're playing multiple games at the same time. It's pretty fun. So, you have different terrain positions. You have the normal one. You have this one. Um, and, see how checkers you start at this, so you go to king. Well, what if my king goes backwards to the other side of the board if I get to evolve again. And this version of checkers do do. You get to evolve to the S king, the B king, the F king. Uh, and they also go to a different one. Um, you can see how each of them move in the slideshow presentation. Also, um, so that some of these don't move backwards, so I made it so that they move forwards to the other side of the board. Um, uh, so, like in Pac-Man, um, it's like a torus shape, the board is, so you can move, like, if you go out this way, you come back over here, or if you go out this way, you come back over here, stuff like that. Then you the capturing work, if you have, like, an FFK, which move multiple spaces in the same turn, they can just, like, go over here and capture all of this. And here's the me explaining that. And we also have normal chests that you play at the same time. And yes, yeah, so you can put um, the pieces off your back burner and put it into normal chests. Um, so that will cause some things. And if you tie the scoreboard, the scoreboard tracks, like if you win here, that's one point, if you win here, that's one point. If you want here, this is just chess, but bigger. Checkers, but bigger. It has all the same rules as, um, this checkers. If you, if, like, I win checkers and the other checkers, but I lose chess in this chess, 
Um, we see whose trading card is better, who has the higher number, and they win. And now, here's the blank version for your own games that you can play. So, yeah, I'll be seeing you eventually where I'm going to play my own game. It's going to be very fun. Um, I hope I win this time. Remember, I lost last time. Oh, and also, by the way, um, so you see this rook here. It can just sort of slide over to the other chessboard. Same with all the other pieces. So, the knight could go like this, and then go like that, and then I could make it on the top layer. And yeah, I could just sort of move around in here. And this does give um, the black, the black chess checkers pieces two turns, so they move like this. And I go, they could also go over here and move like this, but it, it does not give them a turn on the chess piece, on the chess piece over here. Go back, go back a bit. There. So it does not work for. Um, the big chess piece and this checkers over here. Um, so yeah. That's all. And if you didn't understand anything that I said, then that means you should watch the original new chess video. And I explain all the other things there, so you can hopefully play your own game of new chess. Um, it's a very fun and chaotic game. Um... And you will be consulting the rules every few seconds. So, anyway guys, that's the end of another banger video. Tune in next whenever I upload next for another banger of a video. And thank you for watching. Not done the outro in a while, so I probably messed it up. Bye.